The Watson Marlowe 520DI has several pump head options. Here are three of the most popular ones. This is the 520 pump head. It can come in the R or R2 version. The difference being one is for 1.6 millimeter wall thickness. The other is 2.4 millimeter wall thickness. This, is, this holds a single piece of tubing. And you can tell which pump head you have because it'll be stamped right here with the wall thickness. These pump heads can be easily changed. Probably the most popular pump head on the pump is the dual channel 505L pump head. And it takes tubing elements like this, low pulsation tubing elements. A third option are the 313 and 314 series pump heads. They'll look like this. These can be mounted easily on the 520DI pump drive. And again, these are single channel pump heads. Each takes a single piece of tubing, but you can attach up to five of these on one pump drive, and I'll show that in just a moment. Once the adapter plate <clears throat> is mounted, then you can put one or more of these pump heads onto the 520DI drive. I happen to have one that's for the different wall thicknesses of tubing. One is for the 1.6 millimeter wall thickness. The other one is for 2.4. Of course, you can match them. Once you have those pump heads mounted, then you wanna change which pump heads you have in the programming. So you go through the calibration menu and change the pump head and tube. In this case, we're gonna change it to the 313 pump head and then whatever particular tubing wall thickness that you might be using or tubing ID that you might be using. Back to the main menu, you're ready to program your dose.